All right, welcome back to part three. Best six holes in the valley right here. This way it gets really good. I mean, look at the view. You got Phoenix all the way <laughs> We're going to spin it around here and see what... Woo! Dog it! Westworld. What's Westworld? Uh, it's like a... It's like a rodeo spot. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. Par four. They hold Barry Jackson there. 425. Dang. First, the first sight of water, right? Yeah, first hole with water. First hole with water. Oh, Looks beautiful. Lake that you're going to see. Oh, a lake. Okay. Playing. So if you guys are relatively new to the channel or haven't seen the video, um, I, I've been playing Ultimate Frisbee for about 10 years and just had a lot of knee surgeries and couldn't really do it competitive anymore. So I switched over to golf. I started up a golf channel. If you haven't subscribed yet, it's Brody Smith Golf. Definitely go check that out. Uh, posting a lot of a lot of golf content and then also a lot of tutorials and lessons with Cameron McCormick. Uh, so if you want to try to get better at golf or even getting into golf, go check out those videos. Make sure you subscribe, like, and leave a comment. All that fun stuff, you know, because we're just out here having a good time. Look how beautiful this hole is, guys, with this water. The, the fact that it's like a bowl, is that what we're thinking? Well, the water's above the green. Yeah, it's like almost, so you've got like this kind of slope up here and then the water there, but then it dips down. If you look this way, you probably see it on camera. The green is below the water. Yeah, that was a terrible putt. <laughs> Freaking struggling on the greens right now. I've missed what? I think that's three putts inside of five feet. Can't do that out here. So we just hired Chef Renee Langer. Uh, he was the executive chef at the Wynn Hotel the last 12 years. Wow. He's been on Food Network and other shows. And Is the restaurant open, the open to the public? No. It is not. It's just for the members. <laughs> okay. It's just members only. <laughs> yeah. So again, guys, you know, hopefully there's a waiting list for you that you can get on to be a member out here. You know, there's John's house being built. You can see he's got a couple cranes out there. <laughs> uh, but hole 14. 14. Par five. Par five. Little dog leg left. Back up into the mountains here. Okay. Uh, is that the clubhouse right there off to the right? No, clubhouse is down over here. What is that? That's a house. Oh my God. Okay. Well. Uh, I told you about those. <laughs> is, I think it's, what was it, like 18,000 square feet? Is that one? Two bedrooms. Yeah. Two bedrooms? Yeah. That's it. Okay. They have an auditorium in there? That looks really freaking good. Right on the edge. Is that going to cover? Perfect. Great shot. What's the uh, course record out here? 62. Brave line right there. Come back. I need a kick. Fucker. Ah. No. How'd I do that? You sound pretty good. I thought I did too. That was struck way better.
All right, we're out in the uh, out in the desert. Golly, I thought I could carry a pitching wedge over that uh, lip. I think I just kind of had it in the back of my stance and punched it down. song yesterday what was it i think my favorite thing so far playing with these guys is the fact that every hole we go to they is right away driver 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 super aggressive play that's how you have to do it especially when you're just hitting fairways every single time 300 plus it's hard not to go driver 15 from the backs par 4 427 got the sun coming in right over the caddy out there you got a lot of room left. This looks like one of the nicest uh, approach shots in, huh? And what'd you say about that house? That's, how many square feet is that? That one, I don't know. The one, oh, is that a different one? You, that's another one here on the left. Oh, there's another one over here that's a lot and there's only two bedrooms. Wow. Alright, got 134, pin is all the way up in the top, so I'm just going to try to get it up there, get something close. No, Brody. That's not how you want to hit that shot. Hole 16, it's par three. It's got a sweet, sweet walk up here. See you? Yeah, little, I'm sorry, I don't have any Arizona State Frisbees. No, no, I'm just surprised to see Grand Canyon. Yeah, no, uh, I'm, I'm doing a Frisbee, uh, I'm running their practice tonight, so. Oh, you're doing uh, their practice? Yeah, I'm gonna go right after this and do their practice, so. They give us some Frisbees to chuck. Look at this. We used to see. It's like stairway to heaven, but Arizona style. Yeah, this is longer than the song. Yeah. <laughs> no, you know the. You, you, have you heard of Stairway to Heaven, the hike in uh, Hawaii? Oh yeah. You, have you Have you done it? No. Oh, we tried to do it, and a freaking cop came and almost arrested us. That's the one in Kauai, isn't it? Uh, Oahu, about 200 yards or so. Par three. Look at this, guys. Look at this. But we brought the frisbees off. If either one of them can throw it to the red tee box. I'll give him a hundred bucks. I know that it doesn't really matter, but for the heck of it, we gotta put some money on the line. Mine, okay, mine's the same, two degrees up. 
and that was just a plus. Greg's were probably. All right, we are about to do a little long drive frisbee contest. No, you tell me. You guys show me how to throw it. I don't know how to throw it. I don't know how to throw one in. First thing is the grip, okay? Most important thing, just like in golf, you got to have a, a good grip. So for this, we're going to go max distance. All four fingers are going to roll in, and you want it in the meat of your hand. And your thumb is going to be on these flight rings right here on the edge. And you kind of want to have it to where you can feel like you get this motion. Now what you want to do well, is you, used to slapping people. You don't want to curl it. In, don't curl it into your elbow like you were doing. You lose power that way. So ideally, what you want to get good power is get that extension here, and then from here you drive that elbow forward, and you got to get the disc angled this way. See, if, that's the problem. I always yeah, go. I try to get it right there. If you go flat or go here, you're dead. The frisbee wants to correct itself here. So, so you if you start it, yeah, if you start it anything over here, you're dead. Oh, oh it's curling right. That was ugly. So the whole lesson is... The yeah, whole lesson to is don't do what I just did. Well, there's no way. The $100 is dead. Yeah, $100 dead. is dead because that's actually Wait, super deceiving. Way to go out on a limb there, bro. <laughs> super deceiving in how far that is. Yeah, I mean, dude, so, you play golf long enough to know that's not that right. That was way further. Okay, so, when you say right, I thought it was like down here. I'm like, okay, the blue's... So there. really you gotta drive it because it's gonna it's just gonna freaking yank over to the right. Mine went way hard. So get this already in your hand. Like that motion. Like that? And that, yes. Throw it like yes. that. Yes! Throw it like that. It'll Sorry, correct I'm itself. Go oh that. my god, that's freaking on the green. No, you're good. Just really gotcha. focus on vertical. Vertical. No. Okay, cactus. <laughs> Dude, there's no All right. chance I can do it. Okay. That. Not what bad. All right, Ben, you don't have much to beat both of us, so step up to the plate, make a play. Oh! Maximum time aloft with a nice little float. Right next to the car, that's good. Okay, it's Dude, not bad for first, terrible. first throws, not bad. Ugh. Oh, wow. That's a big Go! Thing. Go! Go! Wow, that's oh, way God, so oh, far out there. Woo! All right, enough with the Frisbee. We're back to golf. We got three good looks at birdie here. Ben just found the right fringe a little bit. I've got about 15 feet just over. And then John's got about a 20 footer or so, pin high. Rolling, rolling, turn, turn. Okay, it's a good par. All right, how you feeling the rounds going for yourself personally? Feeling great. So good. When's your next tournament? You so I leave Saturday, November 10th. Okay. Which is my birthday. Ooh, happy early birthday. Thank You're turning you. 24? Four. Yeah, I got, okay. a, I got a 16 hour flight to spend on my birthday. Where are you going? Dubai. Oh, that's the Dubai one. We play in yeah, the DP World Tour Championship, which okay. is basically like the Tour Championship of the European Tour. Nice. Last tournament of the season. Are you excited that you only have one more year until you can rent a car without getting extra charged? <laughs> <laughs> I that's am really, actually. That's really all that 25 gives you. I am. I am actually. It's nice. It's no. It's no. It's great because I, I don't really think about it because you know in tournaments we get they give you we, we get the cars, cars, right? cars right. But in real life. In they're they're life. they're freaking gouging you. Twenty bucks every time you rent a car. Yeah, I mean you're never, getting crushed. I've never had an accident. I mean, yeah, why, why you're a great happen? driver. So, uh, what, is that going to be on uh, American TV, the Dubai tournament? Yeah, we'll but be golf be, channel a little bit. Yeah, I'll be in the mornings here. Mornings here. All right. Yeah. So look out for my boy John. So yeah, because it's, uh, it's odds a, odds of winning three to one. I'm defending champion. Woo! <laughs> Ooh, look at that, boys. Let's go. But it's a tough one to win. It is a tough, tough one. one. All right. I mean, that's just pure. Oh, a little drone, that one? Yeah, I kind of got it on the toe.
playing for the press now, aren't we? Yeah. Give me off this whole melee. Oh, I just, I just hit Give him. me off this whole melee. Ladies and gentlemen, it all comes down to this. Hole number 18 here at Silverleaf. We got a par four playing 445. John Rom on the tee. Before we are on the blues. Okay, we're moving up one tee box. Yeah, we're not walking. I, I can't make it up. The top top of the okay, so this score card now is not valid for me anymore. Well, great. Okay, perfect. So we're actually going to get Metro Donkeys here at Silverleaf, and they're going to take you up to the top. You all the way up. Way. How how high do you go up there? Uh, Steve, that's a all decent way. Just steep. And we're not it's we're, we're out here grinding, guys. We're not you know we're not about to try to pass out or anything. Okay, giving a tea to John Rom. No yeah, big deal. This happens often. You okay, know. never mind. Wow. Well, I'll give you a tea. <laughs> Perfect. We're all friends here. Uh, okay. All right, and uh, last hole. So here we go. Shot. Is that okay. is that too far? Okay. Like that's perfect. Jeez. Well, you told me to start it there and fade it, and then you hit it there. Bullet first. That's got to do something. Sit down is what's pretty pretty much <laughs> out of it. You know what that's got to do is crank. That's got to really do hard. something. That's got to crank really hard. Oh dear. Cut. That's Cut. pretty good. Cut. Cut. Alright, back of the green. South of the ball is great. Oh, it's gonna give me a read this time. Hole 18 all comes down to this. Ben's got a tricky putt uphill 30 feet, but he does own the golf course, so he has a slight advantage knowing the greens. John's got a 20 footer, 18 feet, and he's got a slight advantage because I'm going to give him a read. So here we go. My gosh, he dedicated it to himself, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Lord Jeez. took the wheel. Yeah, pretty much. Just it took a hard left turn it. right at the end. Wow. <laughs> what a round, gentlemen. Wow, that was a pleasure. Thank you so much for the invite. Thank you, sir. Am I in that name now for 62? Woo! All right, shout out to Ben Dude, for hooking me up. Yeah. Course is amazing, guys. Silverleaf, uh, one of a kind. Had an absolute blast with this guy. Shout out to John for showing me the way and showing uh, try. all of us try. basically what it looks like to be number eight in the world. <laughs> Soon to be top three. I'm calling it. After after Dubai, I'm calling it top no, three. I can't get your plan, you can't get top three no, with a no, win? No, 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 What's I the don't. highest you can get after a win? I don't know. There's a lot of math people out there. I Crunch the you. numbers. Let us know in the comments down below. Uh, Hit John to be up. honest, I'll be surprised if after the win I get into top five. Five? Yeah, just because I won last year. Oh, okay. Oh, really? Yeah. So it matters if you win or not last year? Yeah, yeah. Points, it's a two-year ranking. Oh. Yeah. All right. Follow John on Instagram, Twitter, all that good stuff. Check him out on the PGA Tour and the European. You're playing some European Tour events, too. European that's, Tour as well, yeah. That's, that's his, that's his go-to. And hopefully uh, I'll be inside the ropes at some tournaments and showing uh, you guys some inside the ropes with John Rom, man. It was a pleasure, dude. Thanks so much. Pleasure. Dude, just give it a good swing. Good just give camera. it a freaking swing. Yeah.